Well, the McNabb Center is recognizing April as Child Abuse Prevention Month. And now, new this morning, Chase Befelt is live at McNabb's Crisis Center on Merchant Drive, where families can get the help they need. Good morning. Good morning. They turned the lights on for us here at the Family Crisis Center in McNabb. We actually have plenty of people to talk to us this morning about child abuse prevention and the daunting task of doing that. This is an awesome room they have here. They have many of these here. This is the children's respite room where children can kind of come in and and what can they do in this room, Sarah? Kids can just play and get relaxed and feel like they're in a safe place. And this is Sarah Long. She is uh, child abuse prevention at the McNabb Center. But child abuse is one of those things where it's more common than anyone really thinks about. Can you put those numbers into or give us some numbers this morning? Yeah, unfortunately, child abuse prevention is really common. It's estimated that about 700,000 kids across the country every year experience child abuse and neglect. Um, to put that in perspective, that's about one in six children will experience trauma during childhood. Now, numbers are one thing, um, but what about all those that, that don't get reported? It, this is a pretty unreported, uh, terrible thing that happens. It is. We definitely think that probably the incidence of child abuse is higher than that. It's something that some children can't communicate to us. It's really important for grown-ups to know how to look for those signs in their families. But, um, of course, young kids can't always tell us that something bad's happening. So part of April being a prevention month, that is such a, a dawning thing. How can the people watching at home, how can you and I help with something like that? Yeah, there are steps that we can take as a community to prevent child abuse and neglect. So um, we can make sure that families are safe, that they're supported, that they have people they can lean on when they need something, that we um, are supporting parenting skills and knowledge fostering child development, and anything we can do as a community to make sure that we're keeping an extra eye on kids keeps them safer. And if a family is ever going through a crisis with their children, you can bring them right here to the Family Crisis Center off Merchants. It's a very confusing thing. It's off Merchant Drive, but it's on Merchant Center Boulevard. You can come right here and they can help you out, ladies. And they, they do, do such good work over there. Amazing work. We were yeah. just at a benefit for them the other night talking about their veterans program, helping veterans with their mental health. Mm -hmm. I mean, really, all the work they do is expansive and necessary yeah, in our community. It's incredible. Well, it's